In the small ball position of this era, the NBA has never been more blessed with incredible athletic wings. It seems every team has a talented point guard on the perimeter who can get buckets at will. However, they so choose. Among some of the younger standouts include John Moran of the Memphis Grizzlies, Devin Booker of the Phoenix Suns, Donovan Mitchell in Utah, and I can keep going on and on and on for days about these young studs, but I call it the small ball revolution. But the thing about revolutions is their sparks. They tend to die out just as quickly as they set everything ablaze. The actual trend to watch in the NBA is the big man renaissance led by Philadelphia 76ers Joel Embiid and the Denver Nuggets Nikola Jokic, the two current best players in men's pro basketball and their respective Eastern and Western Conference NBA players of the month this past January. How convenient that Embiid and Jokic were named the premier players in their respective conferences. Why? It's almost as if they are also the clear front runners for the NBA MVP and anyone else is grasping at straws. I mean, Embiid is averaging a career high 29 points per game and is generally undefendable on a team sitting in the top four of the Eastern Conference. Meanwhile, Jokic is arguably having a more efficient and productive year thanks to the career best shooting and rebounds total he did when he won the MVP on a battered Nuggets team. Embiid is at plus 220 odds in Vegas to take home his first MVP trophy a year after finishing as the runner-up to who else? None other than Nikola Jokic. Of course, the Serbian big man right behind Embiid is at plus 300 odds in Vegas to take it again. Others like the Milwaukee Bucks, Greek freak Giannis Antetokounmpo, he's at plus 350 odds in the Warriors. Steph Curry is at 380, which is also at striking distance. Even though, let's be honest, they have no chance. The MVP race is an old-fashioned duel of the freakishly sized and offensively gifted men. The NBA will soon name Embiid or Jokic the official best and most valuable player, and there's nothing their bright peers can do about it. It's almost like they're having to defend them on the court night in and night out. They're the centers of attention. See what I did there? And yet they have their way with everyone with brilliant dunks and passes as they please night in and night out. Together, they present the NBA's version of Rampage, and we simply have to hope the league is left standing as these two monsters battle for the recognition they deserve. But no matter what happens, either Nikola Jokic will repeat as the MVP or Joel Embiid will finally walk away with an MVP award.